What's up everybody, Usama here and you are watching Tech with Usama. This is the camera comparison between the Galaxy Note 10 Plus and the S10 5G. First up, we have the Galaxy Note 10 Plus. This one's got four rear cameras. It's got the main 12MP camera, a 16MP ultra wide camera and a 12MP telephoto shooter. The fourth camera on the Galaxy Note 10 Plus is the 3D time of flight sensor. It adds a very nice depth effect to the photos and it's really useful. It has a single 10 MP camera on the front. The Note 10 Plus is equipped with the features like live focus video which also works for the front camera and the rear camera as you may already know that. Other than that it's got all the features that you see in a Samsung flagship camera. Furthermore this phone can record 4K at 60 FPS from the rear camera and for the front camera it supports 4K video recording. On the other hand we have got the S10 5G. Now this phone also has 4 cameras at the back. It also has a main 12MP camera, a 16MP ultra wide camera and a 12MP telephoto shooter. The fourth camera on the S10 5G is also a time of flight 3D sensor. However the S10 5G on the front has two cameras, it's got a main 10MP camera and another 8MP depth sensor. S10 5G like the Note 10 Plus also has got all the basic camera features. It also supports live focus video but only from the rear camera and like the Note 10 Plus it's also got the 4K at 60fps from the rear camera and 4K video recording from the front camera. Let me tell you a little bit about this camera comparison now. First of all, I have shot these images in almost all the possible environments and all the modes that are available on these phones. Same goes for the videos. You will see a lot of outdoor shots. I have uh, tried my best to take some very good night mode shots too. Furthermore, you will find videos in all the resolutions. Remember that I have uh, not used any gimbal because an average phone user shoots handheld videos only and we would also like to take a look at how stable these cameras are since uh, these cameras come with dual OIS on both these phones. You will also find the description of each image and video just underneath or above it. Also I won't be the one to judge the cameras here, I will leave it to you guys. So watch this comparison with all the patience you have and drop your comments in the comment section down below. I would love to hear from you about which camera you like more. And if you are new here, please hit the subscribe button and if you like this video, please hit the like button as well. Here you go with the camera comparison. I will see you on the other side.
This is the front video recording from the Samsung Galaxy Note 10 Plus. I am shooting this video in the 4K resolution. Right now the sun is in my background as you uh, can see. You can get an idea about the mic recording and the video stability for the front camera's 4K videos. I am shooting the same videos on uh, multiple phones so don't get confused when you see this video. Uh, this video is being the same video is being shot on the OnePlus 7 Pro, the Galaxy Note 10, and uh, the Galaxy S10 5G as well. This is the front camera video in the 4K resolution from the Samsung Galaxy S10 5G. I am shooting this video in order to give you an, an idea about uh, the stability and color accuracy from the front camera of the S10 5G in 4K resolution. This video is all set to go in comparison with the Galaxy Note 10 and the Note 10 Plus. Right now the sun is behind me and now I'm going to show you how the background looks in this video. And now this is a front video from the Galaxy Note 10 Plus uh, in the 1920 to 1080p resolution. Unfortunately we cannot shoot the front videos with 60 fps. Uh, right now the sun is in front of me. And you can get an idea how this phone is capturing the background in the front video and also get uh, an idea about the stability. I would like to hear your feedback about this video in the comment section. And now this is a front video from the Samsung Galaxy S10 5G in the 1920 to 1080p resolution uh, as mentioned earlier in other videos. We do not get 60fps uh, for the front camera. In any of the new Samsung devices, you can see that uh, this video in the 1080p resolution is a little bit more stable than the 4K from the front camera. And uh, now I'm going to show you the background as well. You can see if the colors are what you're looking for.
Thank you.